Hey folks, have you ever wished your code editor could do more than just sit there while you type? Imagine having a tool that can write programs for you, suggest improvements in real time, and even predict your next steps. I am Daniel, welcome to my channel where I make smart tutorials. Today we're exploring Z, a next generation editor powered by AI and built by the engineers behind Atom. It's written in Rust for incredible speed, beautifully designed to keep you in flow and collaborative at its core. So coding with teammates feels natural and effortless. Z can write, edit, and refine your code while offering real-time suggestions to help you work smarter. We'll see how it handles everything from file generation to advanced features like inline assist and edit prediction. Also, I've left all the useful links in the description down below, so don't forget to check them out. My friends, Z is a modern next-generation code editor that's redefining the way developers work. What sets it apart from other editors is its deep integration with large language models, which enables some truly innovative features. It includes an AI agent that can write and edit programs on its own. It also offers real-time suggestions and instant help right in your editor. There's also a thread system for commenting and discussing code collaboratively. The most powerful tool is by far the agent panel, here you can use models hosted by Z or connect to others like CloudCode, Codex, or Gemini CLI through ACP. You can also add your own API keys or run local models for even more flexibility. Let's see how this works in practice by creating our first snippet. The agent is now in write mode, so it can create and edit files. You can also switch to ask for questions or minimal for quick chats. For this demonstration, we'll choose one of the most powerful models, Claude Sonne 4.5. I'll ask the agent to create three files, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. The first two will handle the page and styling, and we'll leave the JS file empty for now. The goal is to build an interactive bookshelf that looks realistic, like a real wooden shelf with book spines. Folks, after pressing Enter, we can watch the agent start its work. I can track the Z agent while it actively works on a file. By enabling following mode, I can see exactly where it's currently working in our script and follow its progress in real time. If it's working on multiple files, we can see that too. Right now it's updating the script with the features we requested. Here we see the agent working on the index.html file. Using follow mode, we can see that it has moved to style.css. We can continue tracking it. It then switches to script, where the mode lets us observe exactly what it's working on. This function allows us to monitor which files the agent is currently handling and see the specific tasks it's performing at any moment. Within seconds, all files are created and the agent even provides a summary of what each one contains. Looking at the HTML file, we can see the basic structure, a title, a form for adding books with fields for name and author, and the bookshelf itself. The shelf is still empty because the JavaScript hasn't been activated yet, but the design already looks clean and realistic. The CSS file contains styling and the JavaScript is ready for functionality. Now let's add some interactive features. For the next step, I prompt the agent to add functionality to the file. The request is for the form to create a new book spine element with the title and author when submitted. Each book will be assigned a random color from a palette, so the shelf looks visually appealing. Folks, books should appear with a smooth animation. The form resets after submission, and individual ones can be deleted by clicking on them. The agent works quickly and efficiently, and in moments the script is complete. Refreshing the page, we can see the interactive shelf in action, with books that can be added or removed easily. Once the basic functionality is in place, we can enhance the project further. Z provides an inline assist feature, which allows you to generate or edit code directly where you are working. By placing the cursor at the desired location and opening the inline assistant, we can for example add 3D styles to the book spines. The AI generates the code immediately and we can also introduce practical features like a book and category counter. Guys, let me take a little break to ask you to like this video and subscribe to my channel. It's absolutely free, but helps me make even more fun tutorials for you. Thanks! Returning to the agent panel, we can prompt the agent to create a system that counts the number of books and provides a category drop-down menu. You can choose from different genres, 
from fiction and fantasy to detective stories and classics. Each book displays its category on the spine, and visual separators help differentiate categories on the shelf. Here, my friends, the agent reads all existing files, generates the required code, and seamlessly integrates it with the project. Checking the result, we now see 10 books on the shelf, categorized correctly, with a functioning counter and the ability to add or remove books. Next, we can implement local storage functionality, which ensures that the library persists even after closing the browser. All books, their colors, categories, and counters remain intact upon page reloads. Mates, this feature is added almost instantly, and testing shows that everything works perfectly. We can add a new book, for example, The Hobbit, under the fantasy category, and it remains on the shelf no matter how many times we reload the page. One of Zed's most impressive tools is the Edit Prediction system, which anticipates your next actions. For instance, if I start writing a sorting function and tap, the agent immediately generates the corresponding code, which I can confirm or modify. The Z agent can even suggest multiple sorting options, such as sorting by author, publisher or category. Importantly, you always retain full control over the AI's changes. You can accept all changes with Keep All or reject unwanted edits with the Reject button. Nothing happens without your approval. Z also connects to MCP servers and lets you add several agents so you can compare and contrast. Ultimately, this platform is much more than just a code editor. It transforms the development workflow, letting you focus on your ideas rather than repetitive tasks. All right, friends, that's a wrap. Z isn't just an editor. It's a smart assistant that helps you focus on your ideas while it handles repetitive tasks, predicts your next steps, and keeps your projects organized. Whether you're generating code or refining scripts, Z speeds up your workflow. With tools like Inline Assist and Edit Prediction, coding feels smoother and more fun. If you're excited to try it out, or if you've already used it and have some thoughts to share, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your experiences. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching, until next time.